In our scripture reading this morning, we're going to look at Isaiah chapter 49. And I'll begin our reading at verse 13. Isaiah chapter 49. If you follow along in the Bibles that are in the pews, uh, you'll find that reading beginning on page 726. Isaiah chapter 49, verse 13. <clears throat> Shout for joy, you heavens. Rejoice, you earth. Burst into song, you mountains. For the Lord comforts his people and will have compassion on his afflicted ones. But Zion said, The Lord has forsaken me. The Lord has forgotten me. Can a mother forget the baby at her breast and have no compassion on the child she has born? Though she may forget, I will not forget you. See, I have engraved you on the palms of my hands. Your walls are ever before me. Your children hasten back, and those who laid you waste depart from you. Lift up your eyes and look around. All your children gather and come to you. As surely as I live, declares the Lord, you will wear them all as ornaments. You will put them on like a bride. Though you were ruined and made desolate and your land laid waste, now you will be too small for your people. Those who devoured you will be far away. The children born during your bereavement will yet say in your hearing, this place is too small for us. Give us more space to live in. Then you will say in your heart, Who bore me these? I was bereaved and barren. I was exiled and rejected. Who brought these up? I was left all alone. But these, where have they come from? This is what the Sovereign Lord says. See, I will beckon to the nations. I will lift up my banner to the peoples. They will bring your sons in their arms and carry your daughters on their hips. <coughs> Kings will be your foster fathers and their queens your nursing mothers. They will bow down before you with their faces to the ground. They will lick the dust at your feet. Then you will know that I am the Lord. Those who hope in me will not be disappointed. Can plunder be taken from warriors or captives be rescued from the fears? But this is what the Lord says. Yes, captives will be taken from warriors and plunder retrieved from the fears. I will contend with those who contend with you and your children I will say I will make your oppressors eat their own flesh they will be drunk on their own blood as with wine then all mankind will know that I the Lord am your Savior your Redeemer the mighty one of Jacob finish our reading here from God's Word. In our next hymn, we will sing of the glorious triumph of the Church of the Lord Jesus, hymn number 272, using the Blue Trinity hymnal, hymn number 272. Let's stand to sing.